auto album creation. With Album Express, you can create your own designer album within just a few clicks. Either create a custom size or go to the ready size options. Select a category and select an appropriate size for your album. With the number of pages option, you can define the number of pages for your album. Now click on the next button here and you'll get four different options. That's perfect, auto, eco and manual. To create your album automatically, select the auto option. From the theme window, you can select templates for your album. DG Flick has preloaded more than 1000 templates, which are subcategorized in different categories. Orientation will automatically be selected as per the size selection. From the adjust thumbnail, you can zoom in or zoom out your templates. As per the album type, which and how many templates you'll have to select will be displayed here. You can filter your templates by orientation, number of photos, theme, style, color, and volume. By default, the imported and created templates will be saved under the volume category. Show and hide the My Album tab allows you to view the blank pages of the album. You can manually select the desired theme with the drag and drop option. And a blue color tag with a number on it indicates the number of times the template is used in the album. From the select photo window, you can select the photos for your album. Browse your photos from your hard disk, your CD or DVD drive, your pen drive, your Bluetooth, or even from Facebook. Now select one of the media where your photos are saved. Select the folder to the photos. Select all the photos with the Select All button. Or deselect all photos using the None option. You can zoom in your photos for a bigger, better view. You can also sort your photos by date, modify time, name, size, type, orientation, selection, and also ascending and descending otherwise. From the rotate photo button, you can rotate the photos 90 degrees. Now select the photos, and here you'll see the cover and the page photos have automatically been allotted. This means that the photo having the tag name cover will go to the cover page and the photos containing the number tag on it will go to the number page. The total number of selected photos will be displayed here. You can manually sort your photos. All you gotta do, drag and drop wherever you want. Similarly, you can sort many photos as you want. The select pages on the album will be displayed in the select pages option. The total number of photos required for the album will be displayed in the required photos option. After selecting the photos, click on the next button. Your auto album will be created like this. In the My Album tab, you can view all your auto-generated pages. Lock or unlock the photo by clicking on the lock icon. Select two photos and click on the swap icon to swap the photos. Zoom in or zoom out photos by scrolling the mouse wheel over the image. Click on the photo and move the mouse in the desired direction for online panning. To find out the source of the photo, just right click on the photo and click on the find option. In that, select the photo option. Similarly, you can find the source of the background, the clip art, the border and the mask. The blue color here indicates the object being used on the current page. And the green color indicates the object being used in another page. Now go to the next page. Say here, Right click on this photo and click on the effects option. Here you'll get various options like colorize, blur, opacity, feather, shadow, glow, outline, rotation and presets and blend options. To reset the effects of the photos, select the clear effect option. Now navigate the page and go to the My Album tab. Here enlarge the album tab. You can zoom in for a better, larger view. You can shuffle the sequence of the album page from here. And now your auto album is ready for saving and exporting.